Okay, here we go. Three, two, one. Okay. So can we survive? What about this side? Is the water deep enough? I don't think the water's deep enough. Ugh. Here we go. I'm gonna whirlwind shout myself off of this. We're gonna find out. So if I line myself up with what looks like the deepest portion. Here we go. Oh no, that's land. Oh. So that that's a nope. All right, I'm, I'm gonna try it again. Cause you know, I, I really wanna know. <laughs> I still ended up really far off of that. So if I can get out there, is that deep enough? Nope, doesn't look deep enough. No. Okay, well, what about this side, though? Alright, let's try it. One, one last try. Oh, I didn't change my shout. Why was I twitching? I always say one last try, but it's not true. Come on, baby, be deep enough. No. Oh, but it looks like it might be right there, though. I don't know if I can reach it. You know, I could have walked by this time, uh, but I but I haven't. So, anyways. Oh. Got to change it again. We need to go. Welcome back to episode 32 of The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Punch Cat Fallout. I mean, Skyrim uh, Punch Cat Anniversary Edition Intellectually Not Challenged. <sighs> we got a lot going, guys. We're supposed to go find some crazy guy in a hole. So let's go do that. We also have Sarthal, which is a mission... Um, that we, we will attempt to track down later because uh, we need to f we, we gotta at least finish the stuff we started right but uh, I want to start making some progress on the main story so we're gonna go this direction and uh, I'm gonna not eat myself this time ah! not super yeet anyways. <laughs> Wee! okay that's kind of fun so I'll see you guys there this place looks kind of crazy though what is that Oh, I'm gonna get yeeted. Can you... Can you... Stop yourself from dying by... Oh, well. Good thing I didn't try too hard, because, um... You know. <laughs> didn't have enough shouty sauce. Quit avoiding your death. Really, man? At least you came and took it. Get over here, you wuss. Oh, you're just gonna keep running, huh? You can't run from all your problems. Don't let the dragon drag on, Finn. Ah, good job. There we go. That's a good puppet dog. So did this used to be connected to that? Wow, that is just barely hanging on. Guys, you not nervous about that at all? Wow, that tripped me out. Look at this ice. Isn't that Awesome looking. You can see the underneath now. It's actually transparent. So cool. If modders watch my my stuff, just know that I am absolutely impressed at your abilities. All of you guys and gals in the modding community. You're just so damn amazing. And good job. What am I doing here? How do I get to this hole? Show me the way. I'm so... I can't get over how good this looks. Ah. So, I thought there would be an easy hole in there, but... Oh, what, that's not even the place we need to go. Well, now I just need to discover it. Is that a lonesome tree up there? No, that is a skeleton with a bow. Why is there a skeleton with a bow up there? Ah, I can't... Ah. I just want to... You know what? 
I think we need to whip out our uh, fancy dancy flame breath, not frost breath. Like I did that one time. You know. Dang, these glaciers look so cool. Hey, man. You ever wanted to be yeeted off a, off the side of an iceberg? Cool. Well, I helped him with his lifelong dream. <laughs> He's so everywhere. Look at all the bits. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at how crazy far out you can go. Oh, hey, man. No, don't do that. Actually, yeah, go ahead. I could use some lovely uppies. Ancient Nord Swords. Okay. Well, let's discover. We already discovered this. Cool. Wow, it's right next to the college. Hey, man. Boy, if I'm going to use that full-blown fire shout, I'm going to need to definitely... Um... Wear that necklace. What's up with this guy? What were you guys doing with this guy? Hmm. His jaw's just hanging out there. Oh man, what an epic view. <gasps> That's a dragon thing! It's a thing for dragons! Oh man. Ah, later. We'll do it later. We'll finish that later. All right, I'm uh, not going to eat myself off. Even though I want to, I wish I had my um, gliding suit. Wing, wing suit? Wing suit. And I guess we'll have to come here later. I think almost every marked location has a mission, but I could be wrong about that. And I don't know if we'll get to do 100% on this game. I would like to, but we need... There's lots of other games we need to play. Um, I will discuss the why we're here running. And uh, I, I do plan to change the way I do things a little bit. Once we get to a place where we can stream, I would like to stream two or three days a week with the bulk of this footage. And then two or one day a week, just depending, I would like to... Uh, is this an Oblivion gate? What is this doing here? Oh boy. This looks like uh, an Oblivion gate. But anyways, uh, we'll upload, you know, one special video or one highlight video or one lore video, whatever we determine uh, we want to see and go from there. So that's what I'm hoping to do. That way we can cover way more footage because right now... Uh, we're not covering a lot of ground, so. But I'm not in a position to stream yet, so that sucks. So we'll just keep doing it this way. Uh, what's the best way? Should I just swim out there? It looks like that has kind of a natural land bridge. So let's do that. And away we go. Oh, look. Barnacles. Slaughterfish eggs, not barnacles. That could probably be debated. Epic. We got another little hole over here. Wow, I didn't know there was so much exploring out here. I just want to find it. Just want to find the hole. Look, there's the hole. Oh my goodness. That is a lot of saber cats. That's not saber cats. And I'm glad it's not. Wow, that dog straight avoided that. Hey, man. Stop being rude. You too. Maybe I need to turn the difficulty up again. Everything is feeling real squishy again. I don't know. Is this the hole? This looks like the hole. I just want to yeet myself. Uh, no, this is not the hole. <sighs> I feel bad for dipping Punch Cat in the water. It's real cold, bro. 
Wow. Oh, that's terrifying. I don't know if you guys are afraid of uh, <laughs> water, like deep water, but wow. Oh, God. Oh, I'm stuck under it. Oh. Legit terrified. Well, he's got a boat. All right, man. This is a weird looking hole. Let's go in this weird looking hole. Is he dead? He's moving around. He's not dead. Oh, he's probably crazy. Wow. That's a freaking massive cube, dude. Hey, man. You, uh... You doing all right? Dig, dwemer in the beyond. I'll know your lost unknown and rise to your depths. Huh. Okay. What brings you to this remote place? Ah, the ice entombs the heart. The bane of Kagranak and Degothur. Uh-huh. To harness it is to know the fundaments. The Dwemer lockbox hides it from me. The Elder Scroll gives insight deeper than the Deep Ones, though, to bring about the opening. You have an older Elder Scroll? Like, here? I have seen enough to know their fabric. The warp of air, the weft of time. But no, it is not in my possession. Um, are you all right, man? Oh, I am well. <laughs> I will be well. Well to be within the will inside the walls. Uh, uh, so where is the scroll? Here. What? Well, here as in this plain. Mondas, Tamriel, nearby. Relatively speaking. <laughs> On the cosmological scale, well, it's all nearby. Septimus? Se Septimus? Is that is that how you pronounce it? I'm going to need you to start making sense. I really don't want to hurt you. Oh, a brutish one. <laughs> Septimus has no fear of you. But as one block raises another, perhaps ourselves could help us each. Oh, man. This dude is off his rocker. What do you want? You see this masterwork of the Dwemer? I do. Deep inside their greatest knowings. Septimus is clever among men, but he is but an idiot child compared to the dullest of the Dwemer. Lucky then they left behind their own way of reading the Elder Scrolls. In the depths of Black Reach, one yet lies. Have you heard of Black Reach? Cast upon where Drimmer City slept, the yearning spire hidden learnings kept. <laughs> okay, where is this Black Reach? Under deep, below the dark, the hidden key, Tower Zark. Of Tan. The point of puncture, a first entry of the tapping. Delve to its limits, and Black Reach lies just beyond. But not all can enter there. Only Septimus knows the hidden key to loose the lock to jump beneath the deathly rock. How do I get in, Septimus? Two things I have for you. Two shapes. One edged, one round. The round one for tuning. Dwemer music is soft and subtle, and needed to open their cleverest gates. The edged lexicon for inscribing. To us, a hunk of metal. To the Dwemer, a full library of knowings. But empty. Find Mazark and its sky dome. The machinations there will read the scroll and lay the lore upon the cube. Trust Septimus. He knows you can know. Next you're going to ask me to find your lost android. 
Uh, what do I do with this sphere? The deepest doors of Dwemer listen for singing. It plays the attitude of notes proper for opening. Can you not hear it? Too low for hearing? Hmm, was it an insult? What do I do with this cube? To glimpse the world inside an Elder Scroll can damage the eyes or the mind as it has to Septimus. Uh huh. The Dwemer found a loophole, as they always do, to focus the knowledge away and inside without harm. Place the lexicon into their contraption and focus the knowings into it. When it brims with glow, bring it back, and Septimus can read once more. Hmm. Uh, what do you want with the Elder Scroll? Ooh, an observant one. How clever to ask of Septimus. Ah, uh, boy. This Dwemer lockbox. Look upon it and wonder. Inside I can't. is the heart. The heart of a god. The heart of you. And me. Hmm. But it was hidden away. Not by the dwarves, you see. They were already gone. Someone else, uh, unseen, unknown, found the heart, and with a flair for the ironical, used dwarven trickery to lock it away. The scroll will give the deep vision needed to open it. For not even the strongest machinations of the Dwemer can hold off the all sight given by an Elder Scroll. I see. And what is your interpretation of an Elder Scroll? You look to your left, you see one way. You look to your right, you see another. But neither is any harder than the opposite. But the Elder Scrolls, they look left and right in the stream of time. Uh, the future and past are as one. Sometimes they even look up. What do they see then? What if they dive in? Uh, then the madness begins. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks, Septimus. This big, delicious cube staring at me. All right, man. Oh, he's got a Boethius. Proving. Why does he have that? All right, man. Wait, that was an Elder Scrolls book? Ruminations. All right. Okay. We're, we're out of here, man. You, you just stay put. Oh, boy. Pretty worried about him. Where are we supposed to go? Did we get a new quest from that? We did. Elder Knowledge. Transcribe the lexicon, and then we need to recover the Elder Scroll. Oh, Elder Knowledge is back on top. I met with the Master of the Graveyards. Parthenax, who set me on this path. So, oh, it's not very far, actually. Alftand. Recover the Elder Scroll. And on the way is Sarthal, so I guess we'll go ahead and do that, too. I'll see you guys there. Two trolls. Did this place get dropped down on? That's the heat of the sun, son. That's right. You bum. Dang, man. So is this a mine? Or is this the burial site of one of the sons from the the Red Eagle legend? So I felt discovered. All right. Wonder if everybody else is here. Oh yeah, no, they're all waiting on me. Hey guys. 
This is better than sitting around talking about magic, don't you think? I think we need to be careful. Wow, look at all those footprints. And here we all are. Shall we step inside? Uh, yeah. I'm. I was wondering though, what's so important about this place? We're particularly interested in the prevalence of magical seals placed on the tombs here. It's rather unlike anything we've encountered. Yeah, and we happen to know where those seals came from. Um, and what are we looking for? Anything. Anything at all that might be of interest. That's why I adore this location. We have no idea what we're going to find. And if along the way my message about the dangers of magic should happen to sink in for a few students, that would be a happy coincidence. All right, let's hope that everybody uh, does okay. Hey, can you help me with my alteration? I can certainly share a bit of what I know. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Thank you, sir. All right, I'm ready. Let's do it. All right. Please stay close to me while we're inside. It should be safe. It's always better to be cautious. I'm always ready. I'm Punch Cat. After you. What? Did everybody... Uh, okay. Alright, everybody pile in, I guess. As some of you may know, Zarthor was one of the earliest Nord settlements of Skyrim. Let's get our candlelight out. This is an exciting opportunity for us to be able to study such an early civilization and the magics they use. Well, are there any questions before we begin? Uh, no. What would you like me to do? Ah, yes. Hmm. Well, why don't you see if you can assist Arniel Gain? He's one of our scholars, here working on cataloging our finds. I expect he'd appreciate some help in locating any additional magical artifacts here in the ruins. Any enchanted items will do. The usefulness of the enchantment is irrelevant. If you find anything, the class can look it over. Now let's see. What shall we have the rest of you do? Braylina, my dear, why don't you search for warding magics? Anything designed to keep people out. Don't interact with them. Just identify them. On the map, please search that area over there. See if you notice any residual energies. Alive or undead. Desargo. What shall we have you do? Ah, why don't you verify that we're the first ones here? Look for any amount of tampering with the tombs. All right, everyone. Let's be careful, but have fun. Be careful and have fun? I like both of those things, but I only usually do one. <laughs> it's not careful. Whoa. Where does this go? Nowhere. Caved in. All right, all right. Ah, looky here. Oh, yeah. Cha -cha -cha. Ebony shield. You know, I don't actually have one of those. Oh, I should have emptied my inventory before I came in here. Oh, I'm in my element. I'm looting. We got an arrow. Some leather straps. I don't think anyone else needs them, so I'll take them. Bone mail and scaly filiota. Filiota? Oops. Hiya! Alright, so. Oh. This is the way we went to post to go. What is this? Oh, it's just cool looking. Oh, no, 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 no. Gold. It was really difficult to get at that, but I got at that. I'm not seeing signs of any warding magics at all. 
Either they're not here, or they were removed long ago. Hmm, can you imagine what it was like living here so long ago? The first men in Tamriel, here. It's pretty cray-cray. Jazargo finds nothing but dust in these ruins. I see. Maybe you're not looking Please hard enough. Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Hey, man. Arnail. It's going to take forever to sit through all this. Hey, what do you know about Ar Ancano? He asked far, far too many questions about my research. I agree. I think the Thalmor too many are trying to steal my work. Yeah. I haven't told him anything, of course. What I'm doing is far too important. Can't breathe a word of it. Good, good. I wouldn't say anything to him. Screw that guy. Uh, Tolfdir sent me to help you? What? Ah, yes. You. I remember you. You're going to help? That's fine. Just... Just don't make a mess of my work. <laughs> I've only looked through a portion of this section. It's like he you, knows. Uh, you can look around in the chambers just north of here. Try and be careful, all right? We don't want to damage anything. Uh, okay. Until next time. So, he's probably familiar with the fact that I tend to break things. An enchanted ring. Another enchanted ring. Just enchanted rings laying on the ground? I never find things like this. Another enchanted ring. Lesser soul gem. Some vine. It's vine. Oh, I'm used to seeing those. What do we got here? Ancient amulet. Oh, it's of Sarthal. Oh boy. Uh. What in the world was that racket? Is everything all right? So I think I'm trapped in here. How in the world did that happen? I pulled the amulet off the wall. Really? Perhaps the amulet is important somehow. Is there some way you can use it? Yeah, I'll put it on. Amulet. Uh, so is it Sarthal amulet? Yes. All spells cast uh, cost three percent less. Some kind of resonance. Whoa. You and the wall. It must be connected to the amulet. I wonder what effect might your spell have. All right. Well, let's uh, let's cast. Let's just cast flames. I think that worked. Please be careful here. The site isn't entirely secure. Uh, oh, okay, did you see that? Well, would you look at that? This appears to lead somewhere. Let's see where it goes. All right. We should probably be careful. I have a feeling that, um, uh, you know, <laughs> this may lead to death. Uh, let's just go with the handy, handy, uh, candlelight, and then only in one hand. There we go. That way, if I gotta punch something, I'm ready. Uh, still a torch. I agree. Can I just say that these dragon bone armor gauntlets look amazing? Oh, there's going to be some dudes that pop out of this. this be sealed off? What is this place? I wonder if I need to give him the book that I read. Apothecary satchel. I will take all of that. Unless it's a giant's tail. All right, man, you ready? Yes. Ooh. Uh Hello, Hold, mage, and listen well. Uh, know that you have set in motion a chain of events that cannot be stopped. What? Judgment has not been passed, as you had no way of knowing. Judgment will be passed on your actions to come, and how you deal with the dangers ahead of you. This warning is passed to you because the Sigic Order believes in you. You, mage, and you alone have the potential to prevent disaster. Take great care and know that the Order is watching. 
Uh, I, I, I swear I felt something rather strange just then. What just happened? Did you not see that guy that just spoke to me? I'm afraid I didn't see anything. Can you tell me more about what you saw? Uh, it said something about danger ahead and the Sigic Order. The Sigic Order? Are you quite sure about that? That's very odd. And danger ahead? Why, that doesn't make any sense at all. The Sigics have no connection to these ruins, and no one's seen any of their order in a long time. Perhaps we should take a look inside these coffins. Now, please do be careful. Who knows what we're going to find? What is the Sigic Order? They were a group of mages with a history that predates the Empire. Very powerful, very secretive. No one's seen them in well over a hundred years. They vanished, along with their sanctuary on the Isle of Arteum. I have no idea what connection they'd have to this place. I see. And why is the Sigic Order contacting me? I have no idea, but it's fascinating. Assuming it's true, of course. The Isle of Arteum disappeared over a hundred years ago, and no one has seen them since. As far as we know. And yet now, suddenly, they've chosen to contact you. Why, it's intriguing. If nothing else, I'd take it as a compliment. The Sigics have only ever dealt with those they feel worthy. Snap. All right, cool. Thanks, man. Take care now. I think you should definitely take care. I got a bad feet. Yep, that's what I thought. That's what I thought. What about this one? Are you coming out of there, punk? Oh boy. I, I am. I'm worried about you, man. Bones don't look like they're going to get up. Ah! I need to retexture those things. Oh boy. Let's save a doodle do. Yeah, perfect timing. Oh yeah! Took him out in one shot. Level my armor. Oh, you know what? I probably can't take credit for that. Where'd you go, man? Is that it? I've never seen anything like this in Nordic ruins before. Why, just look at all these coffins. This bears closer inspection. I'd like to stay a while and examine this. You, however, should press on. See if you can find whatever this vision of yours mentioned. But if it is truly dangerous, be careful. I sure will. Go on ahead. I'll be sure and catch up with you before long. Okay. Be prepared to defend yourself. Um, first off, let's... Um... We're just gonna go up and see what happens. Because I definitely think that, um... It's a little too squeezy. Uh, with my dragon armor and all of the stats I've accrued. Uh, so, uh, there's a chain here, and a chain there. Stand back, man. Uh, do they both do the same thing? No. This door now. Alright, man. I'm going. We've entered Sarthal. Okay. Typical ruins here. Uh, I see a, a rune there. Hey man, could you go step on that for me? How about I step you on that? Can I do that real quick? Just gonna... Oh! Whoosh! Bro! Oh cool, I set it off with whoosh, bro. All right, let's get a little candle light. F unrelenting force is kind of the bee's knees. Oops. Pow. All right. Wait, 
Are you? Oh. Alright, we're on master difficulty, so it should start to hurt. Alright, the shields. The shields, guys. Ooh, it's starting to hurt. Oops. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. Alright, we better... We better use a Healy sauce. up a bit. There, that, that jumps down. Alright, I'm, I'm starting to worry again. Yeah, these guys are hitting pretty hard. Take that with your shield. Yeah, bone armor, baby. I think I had an orcish bow. Ancient Nord bows were uh, not, not enough, huh? Blister work. Okay. This looks kind of like a door. No, it's not. Uh, what do we got in here? Just overhanging. Here's a chest. Ow. And we're in. Oh, yeah, bone arrow. Not bad, not bad. Some more blister wort. Let's go this way. Oh, do you see how that glows? Oh, that's so awesome. Coin purse, rubies, some glass arrows. An orcish dagger. An unlocked chest. Another door. Okay, back up to the top. So I haven't figured out. If you guys know, let me know in the comment section below. Down, down below. Uh, I haven't figured out actually how to set up those one through eights without a keyboard. I'd imagine. It's not really meant for without a keyboard, but if you guys know a way, definitely let me know. Hey, man. Whoosh! <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Hey, man. Did you just slide up? Oh, I'm being shot in the back. Am I? Where? Where is this guy? Huh. Well, did that come from him? Flawless Garnet. Nice. And, uh, Extreme Magica. Ew, that guy's still got flesh on him. Oh, whale? Whale. Snake? Hawk. Whale. Snake. Uh, can I move both of them? I can, so do I need to just, uh, is there something behind, ah, looky there, hawk, whale, hawk, snake, is that an eagle or a hawk, there we are, and a whale, well, we go. Ah, look at that. We're masters at this. Open iron door. Oh, we got little footies. I hear the little footies. Where you at, little footies? Whoa. Hey, man. Death Lord. <laughs> Not cool, man. Okay. Is this the only guy? Ebony Battle Axe. Lady, I'm sorry. Alright. I didn't want to use my shout because I was afraid I'd blow stuff around. Alright. I see another rune. 
No traps, and it's not locked. Or of an armor, I don't need to carry that around. Oh, I was hoping there'd be somebody in here. But there wasn't. Oh. Thought they got me, didn't they? Oops. Did I just waste my campsites? I hope not. Okay, so we've got snake. Is this like... Oh, I almost said that it was like too easy. Whale. All right, so I could turn that one and it doesn't turn anybody else. That's aligned. This is not. Okay, so there's an order here. So you. Then you. Nope. And I already tried that one. Now that I've done that one. No. Hmm. And if I turn this one. It doesn't turn that one. And if I turn that one, it turns that one. If I turn that one, it turns those two. Are these three? All of them. So, turn this one to where it needs to go because I can't turn it. I turn this one where it needs to go. Is it? All right, these two are where they need to be. I can change this one to what it needs to be. And then I change this one to what it needs to be because it doesn't change anything else. We've done it. Wow. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna lie, usually I just like oh, pull and, and twist and shoot and do things. Wolf dear! I thought it high time I caught up with you. What? Hey man. What could this place be? Uh it's how do you oh, not know this? Have you not read the legend book? It's short history of Morrowind. I don't know if I have that one. Sweet. Uh, I'll take your stamina. Ruined book. Ah! So, one of the mods <laughs> better disguises the, uh, better disguises the, uh, traps, and I did not see that. Easy now. Iron door. We're now poisoned. Oh, that looks like a mess. Did you see what was going on in there? Steel shield. Common soul gem. Oh boy. What is this? Well now, would you look at that? Uh, I never imagined we'd find something like this. Alright, let's have a talk with this guy. Yurik Galderson. We know him. We know who he is. I can't hurt him with my fisties. You notice that? Alright, come over here, man. Keep it busy. I'll try to bring something. Thank you. That would be great. I see. He's protected by it. Oh, boy. Oh, we're just cooking him now. Oh. Tolf, dear, that was amazing. Okay, so we have another Galder am 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 amulet. amulet. Amulet fragments increase magic by 30 and the writ of sealing. Seeing this, am I? Boy, no, we're both this seeing is this. Utterly unique. Yeah, I'd say. Buddy. Uh, can I? Tolf dear, don't get too close. This is simply fascinating. What is this thing? I have no idea. This is amazing. Absolutely amazing. The Archmage needs to be informed immediately. He needs to see this for himself. I don't dare leave this unattended. Can you return to the college and inform Savos Aran of this discovery? Please, hurry. I will. Um, something tells me that uh, that Thalmor may have known about Prepare this thing. To defend yourself. Staff of Yurik. 
Alrighty then. Well, that wasn't too bad. I shudder at the thought of what it would have been like without Tolfdeer here. Uh, maybe I would have been able to clear the magic. Or maybe I should have just used a drain magic spell on him. Alright. What's through this door? Oh, yeah. Oh, look at how beautiful that is. Just the beautiful looking chest nestled in the fern. It's so good. We learned ice. Ice form. Nice. So, can I unlock further? Oh, ice form. Your thumb freezes his opponent solid. <gasps> That's awesome. We are definitely going to try that one out. All right, what do we got in here? Bone arrows, fire arrows. I don't want the glass helmet. Ice arrows and soul stealer arrows. On a lethal blow manifests itself into a soul gem filled with the soul of the target. You have got to be kidding me. That is amazing. Oh, I'll be taking that. Oh, I need to craft those. Too bad I don't use bow very often. All right, we're leaving. This place is crazy. Alright, we gotta make sure that doofus doesn't find out. I don't like him. Hey guys. Is it up above? Okay. Archmage's quarters. I was walking in his room. Hey man. I hope I'm not being what? Oh. Whoa. This is pretty. Hey, buddy. What you learn here will last you a lifetime. Several, if you're talented. Ah, uh, Savos. You are relatively new here, are you not? I have noticed you, but we have not spoken. No, we haven't. Then allow me to introduce myself. I am Savos Arin. Archmage of the College of Winterhold. I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here. But I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the College. Are we clear? Absolutely, man. Uh, but I do need to speak to you uh, about Sarthal. Please don't tell me that another one of the apprentices has been incinerated. <laughs> I have enough to deal with right now. Why does that happen often? We, uh, we found some sort of orb. Tolfdir wanted you to see it. I see. I trust that Tolfdir will provide a more specific explanation. Thank you for bringing this to my attention. Tolfdir normally looks after your little group, yes? Since he's apparently occupied, and I will need to see this discovery for myself, I think perhaps you should begin researching the subject. Speak with Urog in the Arcanium. See if he's aware of anything that matches your discovery. And good work. The next time you find yourself exploring Nordic ruins, perhaps this will be helpful. Nice. Staff of Magelight. Nice, that's really good. Uh, you guys notice that basket's twitching? <clears throat> Okay. Uh, dangerous research must be a problem here. Not often, no. Some risks must be taken, to be sure. I am simply trying to avoid untimely deaths. We also must make an effort to avoid worsening what Skyrim thinks of us. That's fair. Nobody seems to have... Uh, uh, the Nords, I think, are the only ones that don't really like magic. I'd like to know more about the College's history. I've seen documents dating back to the late Second Era. Beyond that, it's hard to say. Events in the last several hundred years resulted in a significant loss of our history, I'm afraid. What happened in the last few hundred years? The Great Collapse, as it has come to be known. An unfortunate natural disaster that ravaged the area. The college fared far better than the city of Winterhold, but it was not left untouched. 
Uh, I like that you're able to read and also chat with me and not look at me even once. What caused the Great Collapse? No one is sure of the cause. Some believe the eruption of Red Mountain had far-reaching consequences that were only felt years later. I know there are some who have blamed the college, said that we were responsible. I assure you this is not the case. I see. Uh, could you tell me any more about the Great Collapse? The sea of ghosts practically came alive. No one was expecting it. Monstrous waves battered the shore for weeks on end. Winterhold was ancient and weathered, but it couldn't withstand the sea's fury. The entire districts of the city were lost overnight. The waves receded in time, but the damage was irreversible. Most residents of Winterhold abandoned what was left of the city. The college survived, and so here we remain. Hmm. What's the purpose of this college? Purpose? I should think it's self-evident. Magic is a true power. Not something to be shunned by commoners, or treated as an amusing diversion by politicians. It shapes worlds, creates and destroys life. It deserves proper respect and study. The college is a place where we can focus on that, without the pressures of the world weighing down on us. I see. Have you ever met with the Sigic Order? Personally? No, not I. One of their number used to advise the Archmage when I was but an apprentice here. But that was a great many years ago, before all the members of the Order were called back to the Isle of Arteum, and it disappeared entirely. Hmm. Maybe we'll find now more on that. Excuse me. Yeah, absolutely. What's this? Uh, some about Sarthal? Hmm. Wonder if I might be able to snag that. What you learn here will last you a life. Time. Several if you're talented. Seems to be okay. Alright, well let's go talk to Urok. Ur Urgog. Back down this way, I guess. Oh. There you are. I've been trying to find you. Oh. I just wanted to let you know that Ancano's been asking about you. I think he's looking for you. Uh, why would Ancano be looking for me? I'm not sure. Just, well, mind what you tell him, all right? Uh, yeah. Uh, is there a problem, though? No, no. Well, I don't think so. Between the two of us, there are rumors about him. That this advisor position he has is a sham, an excuse. That what he's really doing is spying for the Thalmor, trying to feed them information. Whether it's true, I can't say. But it never hurts to be a little suspicious, does it? Thanks for the warning. You're welcome. Oh, Until wait, next wait, time. wait. Can you help me in destruction? Mirabel does a fine job as Master Wizard, I suppose. Still, there's always room for improvement. Well, she's doing a lot on her own. Certainly. Destruction. Concentration spells can be cast immediately, though they're weaker. Good for a tight spot and less costly if you miss. Hmm. You'll also need to decide whether to devote yourself to a single type of spell. Focusing solely on flame spells will make them more powerful, but you may find yourself at a disadvantage against foes immune to fire. I see. Uh, could I get training? I can teach you, but I won't be held responsible for what you do with the knowledge. I really thought that... Aww. Well, thanks anyways. All right, then. Ancano's just got to get a punch in the face. Uh, let's see. We need to... Uh, hitting the books. Speak with Urgog. Hey, man. Hey, man. I got some more I questions. I want to see you any of these books poorly. Are we clear? Yep, you got Hundreds it. Hundreds of years have gone into assembling this collection. It's going to stay pristine, understand? Uh-huh, we've been over this. I need to learn something about what we found in Sarnathal. I know what you want. Word travels fast around here. Apparently. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not anymore, anyway. What? You don't have anything that can help? I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. 
Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Of course. Doesn't anyone care that Orthorn stole these things from the college? Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just to let them sort themselves out. Ah. Uh. Although now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Mm -hmm. Good luck with that. Of course. Who is Orthorn? He was an apprentice here at the college. Not very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left, he took off after them. Stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. Mm hmm And why are these mages in Felglo Keep? Let's just call it a difference of opinion with the college. They were interested in research that goes outside the bounds of what the college allows. So they were persuaded to leave. Uh-huh. Okay. All right, thanks, man. All right, then. Cool. Let's... Uh, here we go. You there. I have questions for you. I don't really care. You were in Sarko, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. Um... Maybe. I know full well that you have. Please do not insult my intelligence. Tolfdir is still there now, is he? I shall expect a full report when he returns. Mm-hmm. Um, how do you know anything about this? It is my job to know these things. My role as advisor to the Archmage is aided by knowing everything that transpires here. Uh-huh. Thank you for your help. You may go now. Yeah. I think the college is due for a change in leadership. Oh, that's great. Have fun with that, lady. Song of Return? I don't know that. Um, I have many. Important yeah, whatever. Blah 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 blah. Whatever, guy. Are you quite sure we need to be speaking? No, I'm sure we don't. Actually, why don't you go suck on a lead pipe? <laughs> I don't know where that came from, but I don't like the guy at all. What? Uh. Anybody else just just see that? He's just hanging what out, you Samuel. Learn here will last you a lifetime. Okay. Several. Thank you for that canned dialogue that never gets old. All right, guys. Well, unfortunately, can that is all the time we have in this episode. I was hoping we would make it to uh, progress into the Dwarven Dungeon, but next time that is where we will pick up. We did recover another amulet of the Red Eagle Legend. That's pretty cool. Uh, so I will see you guys in the next episode. If you like the video, slap that like button. If you want to see the other videos in this series and the other series I have on my channel, hit that subscribe button and a little bell icon so you know when I come out with new content. If you actually want to know when I come out with new content, hit the link to the Twitter and the Discord where we share all our fun adventures. Right, Aura? That's right, Aura. All right. I'll see you guys in the next episode.